a modern city with ancient roots, with mighty kings ruling the bountiful island, locked away in the mountains with thick foliage, where the past meets the present seamlessly. Kandy was the capital of the last generation of Sri Lanka's kings until it fell in the hands of the British in 1815. Kandy was originally known as Senka Dagalapura after a hermit named Senkada who lived there. Many of the Sinhalese people call it Mahanuara, meaning the great city. While traveling smoothly on the Sri Lankan highways to Kandy, our experiences were memorable at various locations and landmarks. The Kutmali Tank at Ramboda journeying through the darkness of the Ramboda Tunnel, experiencing the gushing spray of waterscape at the Ramboda Waterfalls. Take your choices pick from the fascinating array of Sri Lankan handicrafts and curios from Oak Ray stores. Enjoy, sip and savor best tea variety in the tea boutiques and the well-maintained tea garden stores which fall on your way. Say your prayers silently at the Sri Bhakta Hanuman Temple, impeccably maintained by the Chinmaya Mission. And experience and enjoy some Pera Hera traditional dance moments and movements on the highways itself. With every move enjoy Sri Lanka and soak deep into the Sinhalese way of life. Kandy, located between multiple mountain ranges, including the Knuckles mountain range and the Hanthana mountain range, giving the city an elevation of 500 meters above sea level. Kandy is both an administrative and religious city and is also the capital of the central province. Kandy is the home of the Temple of the Tooth Relic, one of the most sacred places of worship in the Buddhist world. It is also the second largest city of the island. Upon reaching Kandy, we stayed at Hotel Topaz, nestled on the top of the Annie Wat Mountain, an expansive serene niche experience on the mountains abode. We were welcomed with refreshing mocktails upon arrival by the helpful and smiling staff. You are spoiled for choice with the delectable spreads of local and international cuisine for every foodie at Hotel Topaz. We were on our way to catch a bite at the famous Senani restaurant famed for its stunning views looming over the Sri Lankan city of Kandy and the picturesque Kandy Lake. The Sanani restaurant is located in Sini Kandy 
and is surrounded by tropical greenery. Replete with hospitable staff, one can enjoy scrumptious meals of various cuisines while enjoying the spectacular view. Kandy is also home to one of the oldest churches in Sri Lanka, as old as its Portuguese foundations. St. Paul's Church is an Anglican church, one of the oldest and most historic churches in the city. It dates back to the early 18th century with its beautiful arches, grey walls and stunning stained glass artistry holding secrets unknown. Today, the congregation consists of a large mixed crowd of individuals. The Sinhalis, Tamils, Burghers and Europeans who stay in Sri Lanka for longer periods. Mesmerizing beauty of an island tucked far away in the world, bringing with histories and possibilities, such is the charm of the Sinhalese paradise. Mm -hmm.